Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Mr. Cummings here, and we're back again playing some more Hearts of Iron for the Great War. Way, way we left off in the last episode, uh, we were just setting things up, but anyway, let's get straight into it. Let's have a pause. Put on speed 5. So, like I said, we will be we just um, going ahead and setting things up. We do have to send a division over to probably the infantry, probably the first infantry division. I actually will. I'm thinking about sending the first, I mean, so the second light cavalry um, to good old England. Welcome to the Great War. Holy crap, this is different. <laughs> uh, you are a veteran player of Hearts and Vine series. Do you, and you want to experience a new challenge, add difficulties to the game, pick one of the four options. Holy sh shit. <laughs> uh, not today? Hmm. Tilly Willy. <laughs> oh. That's actually kind of funny. Um, let's go with this one. They're going to burst my bubble there. But, um, man, this is different. <laughs> Holy crap. I play as a minor as the beginning because I really want to play as Australia. Because cause Australia and New Zealand played played a decent part during World War One, so. Even early on. But man, are they already throwing that at me? <laughs> Day one? Um, but yeah, that's insane. Actually, should I send my divisions to Kuwait? Hmm. Is Ottoman Empire part of. Like allied with the Ottomans? No, they're actually part of the Entente. Who's part of the Entente? Just mm, mm. William the Seventh. He cocked it. George the Fifth is now is the new king. Oh great. Um, I'm, that's not a bad thing. I'm just saying, like, oh great, because, well. What currently? What's some, one one of my family members watching? I'm a puppet. Oh, I know that's um. I almost freaked out saying that shouldn't be a thing. I got my independence. Like, should I should go. Yes, I am. What the hell? Okay, should I go their independence over in, um from from England in 1901? What? <laughs> okay. Some some my 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 say no they didn't mm, yes they did <laughs> yes they did same as New Zealand as well holy crap how many puppets do they actually have Australia wow a lot of nations actually <laughs> a lot of the nations up up here as well. Right here, is that? Might, might have to tell them that. Oh well. So I'm guessing we're sticking with the... with the, with the good old allies and I'm sending the first Light Cavalry Division and the Infantry Division to... <laughs> Yemen. Actually. I sure send them over here. Ooh. Actually no, I'll, I'll leave them in... Melbourne, for a bit, because I'm not doing any damage there. Is this Melbourne? Yes, it is. Okay, cool. Um, we're already in May. <laughs> well, we're start off in May, so we got 50 guns per each day. 0 0.10, 10. What the hell? <laughs> Well, saying this, it is early weaponry, so it is early guns. It's probably like the very early. Um, that was quick. <laughs> well, there is Albania. Is Albania not a thing just yet? I think Albania was founded in 1911, like in 1911, I'm pretty sure. So, became a country at that time. Montenegro, <laughs> small little country. 
Well, one, one of my friends live in Montenegro, and he's playing as a nation there as well. So, and I forgot to put it into the put it into the description. Oops. How far? We got a little bit left. Okay. So we Australian. Can we get our in, in, can we get our official independence? Because it was nine years ago from from from, from, from this point. <laughs> God, damn it! Does Jimmy have any puppets? They shouldn't. Nope. They're allied with Austria Hungary. Italy might join the. Oh damn! They're already doing it. <laughs> Hey, how do they start off with... I should have that as well, I'm pretty sure. That's a weird flag for Afghan... for Iraq. Uh, I'm so used to like... Huh. Liberal. Can I get my in Can I get my independence? You can't do this one. That's kind of sad. It's kind of weird. I wish you can sell weapons. Ho <laughs> ho. Change warfare. Yeah, that's that is a thing, right? We can make out. We, we can help it with, with our trenches and stuff in this game, right? We can also help with with our tanks. <laughs> anyway, I said that in a weird way. And also our torpedoes as well. Radios. Man, this is different. <laughs> um. Oh, okay. Just looking at these, and it's like, whoa. <laughs> There's oil. Oh, wow. Okay, that's it. Uh, okay, well, we can't build changes just yet. Man, this is weird. Anti air? Anti-aerial guns. Oh man, we can get, get those. But that's quite a, that's quite a while. Land forts. We can't even build build those yet. Oh wow, well, they got the independence the the thirty first of May. Okay. Reinforced. Con oh okay, that makes more sense. Then. Reinforced concrete. So South, South, so South Africa is a thing. They don't have uh, that part of territory, and I think nope. They don't. They do not have Southwest Africa. <laughs> it's kind of disappointing there, but lots of Germany, like Germany, did have tons of claim over Africa and around the world, even in uh, China, even. So yeah, that's the thing. It's quite it's quite interesting to see how the world has changed throughout the years. Like now the world is more like 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 Germany's like oh, a bit iffy with the whole war scenario. Oh. Okay, I was I, um, I was about to say, why doesn't um I can't do not have any resources? Hungary has a different flag. Hungary has a different flag. <laughs> it's the um the kingdom of Hungary's flag. Good old Ottoman Empire. It's part of Turkey. Well, Turkey has 
claims on it. I'm pretty sure... Yeah, yeah, it does. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Um, what I'm... Whoa. Oh, they were getting their independence. Like a so, 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 like Yemen. Or Monday Yiki. Ye Yemen. I, I know so I'm pretty sure, uh, by here as well. But it will become Yemen territory. So, yeah. Yeah, Yemen here and Al-Ali. Most of Arabia now. So, yeah. <laughs> There's that 42 people. <laughs> Still is a. They haven't got older, they haven't got younger. Man, this is extremely different. So, I was going to go alternate history as all hell and be, and yeah, and like and like join the uh, um, central powers. Maybe not, <laughs> but oh well, that's fine. Like to me, it's like I don't normally play a, a democracy country anyway, so it's going to be quite interesting to see. And also, where do I fight? <laughs> so where is is where do I lay down the very first bullet? Like Australian bullets. <laughs> so yeah, can I? Can I? I don't know. Make a division now. Holy crap! I got infantry battalions as well. <laughs> I don't need those really. Yeah, I don't need them. I know that they're what what we use now. Um, we 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 use brigades and battalions and stuff. But that's how we work. But, um, I'm going to go with divisions. I'm going to go with five of them. Five divisions based in Melbourne. We didn't even have these many divisions in World War Two. I'm sorry, in World War One, even in World War Two. <laughs> so, yeah, I just, I just tripled our numbers. I'm actually going to re rename this, um, like, the Light Wars. There we go. Because that's what it's technically is meant to be called. And also, it's brig, it's battalion. So I'm gonna rename that battalion. Battalion, battalion. This is field commander. <laughs> um, battalion. There we go. Infantry battalion. There we go. I'm, I'm going to send these protective cruise. Can we still produce protective cruises? Is that a thing? Also, by the way, that's what we're going to be using. We cannot use these. Um, the other protectors. See, uh, powerful. Raider, pretty much we have to get all the way down the very last one. So to get the other ones, so yeah. But that's fine. I, I, I totally agree with that. And this is this, by the way. <laughs> I didn't do this one just yet. Hang grenades for like heart attack. It's meant to be soft attack. Um, but. Because there's no real need for it just just yet. <laughs> you can't get captured just yet. That, that, that makes sense. I'm probably get mount. I'm probably want be using these type of unit. I'm gonna get marines anyway, but I won't be using mountaineers because the war might be over before that happens. <laughs> um, flamethrowers. Oh yeah, that makes sense. Because flamethrowers were used in World War One. The first active use were by by the Germans. So yeah. Trench mortars, trench mortars, trench mortars. I like this. Early support weapons. It's like light mach. It's like little. Um, it's like the very early Maxim machine guns. So yeah. But like I said, I'm going to send the those ships to. Where? 
to Southeast Africa? Ooh. Actually, I own this territory up here anyway. So send there. So I, can, so I can say, like, have my ships deployed here and cut off supplies over here. When I have the divisions, they send them over there. So, so yeah, I actually will send a division over there anyway to, to keep um, Port Moresby safe. Where's Port Moresby? Right down here. Pretty sure this is Port Moresby. Yep. Yep. Cool. So keeping Port Moresby safe would, would be quite interesting and also taking on at all these islands. Because, yeah. Yeah, Jimmy had control over all this territory because they were like, screw it, why not? Cool. Is that wait? No, okay. Okay, we got that. Um, let's go with political. Stuff like that. Actually, what I should have gone down was military effort. Yeah, I should have gone down that. Or I should have kept on going down this one. But um, airships will be like the aviation tech tree won't be a very useful for me much but um i'm still going to be doing it same as the navy well well same thing this the navy would be quite quite useful because one i am a nation that is very far away um i'm going to go down with flexible navy actually yeah and go anti submarine because carriers not so not so useful inside of this game so yeah, because aircraft carriers fight at like battleship range, so it's kind of dumb. So yeah, um, let's go in here quickly. Can I put coastal? Hmm, I really want to build bunkers, but you, but I can't. Can't build bunkers until um, 1916, but by that time, it's probably the war. It's probably over. Cause what my friend has told me, and this is what he says, the war ends really quickly. <laughs> cause, cause like Allies gang up on Germany pretty quickly. So this might be a short series. You never know. <laughs> Japan, Korea, and Asian Treaty. The Korean Empire, um, a Japanese puppet. Uh, since the, the assassination of of Queen Ming in 1895, has joined, has just signed a treaty with the, with the Japanese government that um, expects a full annexation of yeah full annexation. Though the Russian Empire and the United States are committed about the means, no official actions have been taken against the Germans yet. It seems that Korea is long... well, it's deboned. It's going to be a thing until 1945. So, yeah. It's going to be quite annoying. I mean, it's quite interesting. So, yeah. I think, actually, for a historical point, um, Japan should not have a really decent sized navy at this point, right? Who's the emperor? Oh, emperor, okay. Yeah, they didn't have, they didn't have a big huge army. On the other hand, this kid has a decent sized navy, I mean army. Great Britain should have the biggest army currently. Actually not that very big, for France does. But France had a bigger army, but they were still pretty technologically behind in that regard. Journey was a different story though. Well, we all know what good old um, Austria hung hung Hungary did. So these guys were a bit weird. You do have these like these traits. I should probably check mine if I get any. 
No, I do not. But Great Britain, Great Britain, Great Britain does. Um, scramble for Africa, just five will go, uh, minus 2%. Recoupal po po population, 0.10% uh, because of recruiting um, Africans into the army. And drift defense, plus 50. But anyway guys, that's the end of this episode, so I hope you guys enjoyed. Ch chat for now.